Hill of the Tomorrow's Engineers EEP Robotics Challenge. We've got 21 of 100 teams that have taken part in the challenge this year. Schools are provided with quite a complex bit of kit, but it's exciting, it's Lego robots. There's three components. There's the robot challenge, which is the tabletop contest where they build a robot that has to complete a bunch of tasks. In a, in a time limit. And there's also a research component where they have to present on uh, an aspect of robots in space. And there's also a teamwork challenge which is done on the day. They don't know what that is beforehand and so they have to like respond to the challenge on the day. It's really amazing. I, didn't, I wasn't expecting this many schools at all. And it's, there's a really good atmosphere. All the fun we've had, like building it, making it our own thing and then making it to do what we want it to do, it's just something special. We have got to push satellites out into space, shoot a rocket, bring a rover over a ramp, collect astronauts, so it's quite full on, all in five minutes. It's really exciting that you start training teachers a year ago and then you get to come here today to see how your knowledge and skills have been passed on through teachers to children and that's the really exciting part of it. Every kid here has something to offer and I think that's the most important thing is communicating to kids no matter what your skills are you have something to offer engineering. STEM for us is all about the perceptions about what it means to be an engineer. It's not all about nuts, bolts and spanners. It's not all about sitting at a computer desk all day. There is so much more you can do with STEM activities and actually showing them that link. I think people are beginning to realise that having a, a career in engineering is not only financially worthwhile but extremely rewarding. It's amazing what the, the children have managed to build into the robots, well impressed. I've got high hopes for them in the presentation because they did really well with that um, and at the end of the day they've really enjoyed it. You might be able to talk about a lot of the stuff, you might be able to program in some of your lessons but hands on with a robot trying to do these missions would just be impractical and so it's great fun and then the idea of going out for the day to a big event like this is just amazing. The students who are programming they've really really enjoyed it. We've had students who have really struggled previously socially um, and this has had them an opportunity to work as a team to grow friendships more than anything. A lot of girls, females here today who've been talking to me today about how inspired they've been and how it started them on a, a different track in their thinking. It's about giving young people the opportunity to choose. We've just made like Nottingham proud. <laughs> <laughs> it was a great experience actually. Uh, it's nice to kind of go to school and do something different. All of our other academy schools, we've recommended it to all of them, so hopefully they'll be in it next year as well. We've already got ideas for next year, um, and I think they will probably become our ambassadors for, for our future students who want to take part, so this is definitely not the end.